Hey guys and welcome back to Infinifactory, but before we get going, today is Monday when I said I was going to do the draw, so let's uh, flip over to my desktop. Whoop! Look at that, there we go. And we shall... I've got, well, I've got all the names, I've got random.org here, so let's uh, random a number from 1 to 24, super easy. Boop, 24, generates... Come on. 19! Number 19, the lucky Bob Watson! Tick. Okay, Bob, you shall, by the time that this video comes out, you shall be able to find the key sitting in your inbox on YouTube. So, anyway, enough of that rubbish. Let's get back to Infinifactorying. Let's, uh, I want a yellow one. Right, what are we doing? Resource site 526.81. Puzzle, optical sensor array, type 2. Let's do it. Let's take three hours to get something that could have been done a lot easier. Ah, okay. You, you have a blinky light. Hello. If you're Ooh, listening to this message, rotation. I want to congratulate you. You made it this far, and that's really saying something. The name's Floyd. I was one of the first human abductees, so that makes me a bit of a geezer. I was picked up back in the summer of 1976 from a little town no one cares about in Illinois. I wasn't even 18 yet. Those were, uh, interesting times. In almost 40 years, I've learned a thing or two about our gracious hosts. <laughs> I kid, of course, but they're really not that bad. They're just, uh, insensitive, you know? They think humans are useful. Uh, we're good at making stuff, and they don't want to do it themselves. It's easier just to have us do it. I've picked up a bit of their language here and there. I, I can't exactly speak it, since our vocal cords don't really work in the same way. I've made some approximations of their language. Uh, Earth is something like... Yeah, it kind of sounds like you got a frog in your throat, but, you know... It's not much use, but it's given me something to do in the past couple of decades. Ah, uh, I'm gonna do it. I want to see how this, uh, how this stuff interacts with each other. Hmm. Okay, so that will just push it straight that way. Can I do this? Will that evenly like insert it between these things or Yeah well beautiful Ah but then what do you do Stejo you blumbering you blubber blumbering blubbering idiot Unless there happens to be another one. No, there's not. Ah. Okay, how do we check that this is... I mean, we don't... There is, there is no other one of these things now, is there? Really? No, there's not. Okay. So, what we do need to do is... Hmm... Oh my god, you're such a fool. You are such a fool. Such a fool. Right, let's have... Oh my god. Go like that. Wait, no. One, two... Um... Jesus Christ, I can't believe I'm an idiot. Uh, I can't believe I'm such an idiot. Um, You go there. Let's get a Devil's Face and Welder there and there. 
Jeez. And it to go there. You can bug it off. For some reason, I thought that these things needed to be stamped at both sides. Uh. Ah, right, okay, because... What I need to do is I need to get one of them... Ah, okay, so it can't... Right. So I need you to turn it. Stamped. Turn. Push it off, that turns it again. Okay, I can't do it all in a line like that, that's just dumb. Um, I need to have... I need to gather two. Okay, they'll both be stamped at the, the same side, so I can't get it so that it... Right, so that they're stuck together at all. Alright, and my pusher, there and there, so once there's two of them, I'll push them both off. Oh, uh, seven, let's go underneath just to make it a bit, ne a bit neater. Okay. And we need a block here and hmm okay so that's going to push that round twice but we need that to be there all right we need a Sensor here. Dot R, we need E, Stigio E. And then. I'll push it that way. And we also need, on top of this, we need two downwards welders. Let's just double check, this won't actually work now, will it? Because these two can't have something touching them at the other side. Okay. So let's have you there. Ugh, I don't know what I'll do with you yet. I'll, uh, I'll mess around, I suppose. All right, and then there. What happens now? So he goes that way and can't fucking turn because I'm an idiot. That's all cool. Um, and nine. Get rid of that. Now what happens? Alright, you get pushed on, that gets twisted, you turn to wait on the next one to move you. Okay, now you're facing that way. Can I do something here? That's the right way for it. No, I can't. I should just... Arg.
Okay, what if I put you down there? Hmm. I need to do this on the other side. Because this one needs to be facing this way, but this one is the one I need to turn. So turn it there and turn it there. So just double check. Turned, uh, it gets turned. Okay. So we've got this one facing this way. One, two, three, because one, two, three. And for this, we need. Oop. Oh, <laughs> idiot. There we go, and we then need to... Do this. There we go, and does that work? Oh, beautiful. Would you look at that? What happens if we do this? Oops. Excuse me? Why did that one not get stamped? What the heck? Why did that one not get stamped? That's so shit. That, that, I think the game messed up there. So I had it on super speed. Wait, what? Why is the first one not getting stamped? Ah, right, okay, it is getting stamped. Right, makes sense. It can only be at a certain number of cycles. Yeah, because of the time it takes them to get round. Okay. Okay. Oh, so close. Yep, needs to just be one. That's a shame. Yeah, that sucks. Done. Jobs are good. Look at that. See? Oh, apparently I've done a lot. Oh, wow, fat he'd bet me. But I bet him on footprint. Ah, suck it, fat he'd. Yeah, he bet me on cycles. Uh, that was just right. I suppose there's probably a, an easier way to do that. I don't see how. <laughs> that seemed like a pretty easy way to do it, to be honest. Um, yep, continue to my cell. Do, do, do. The rotator. Rotators are used to rotate groups of blocks. Hmm, I wonder if there's an easier way for me to do that last one. I wonder if I could have welded them to... Nah, screw it. Uh, rotators are used to rotate groups of blocks. They have pressure sensitive surfaces which trigger rotation when blocks are placed on top. They reset when all blocks are removed, allowing them to trigger again. Both clockwise and counterclockwise variants of the rotator are available. A la landing alignment lights. Let's go have a look at it and we will see what we think before actually doing it. Alright, okay. Uh, red over red, you're going to hit your head. Blue over blue. Uh, it's actually white over white, you're going to go out of sight because we don't really have blue in landing lights, but maybe in space we do. Okay, so I need a red and blue and then to twist it round. And then every two I need to twist one and then, yeah, okay. Oh, you... Wait a minute. Oh, you give me a red and blue. Oh, that's a lot easier. So all I need to do is align them in groups of four. 
Okay, that should be pretty easy actually, but it's going to have to be in the next episode. So, as always guys, thanks a lot for watching. I've been CJ, you've been awesome, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.